Kelsey Van Paris, and welcome to this week's Better Health in 90 on making physical activity work for you. The physical activity guidelines state that adults should aim for 30 minutes of physical activity per day, while children and adolescents should aim for 60 minutes per day. While we're familiar with these recommendations and they're pretty straightforward, the options for hitting our physical activity goals are endless. So let's get to it. To stick with a physical activity goal, we must first reframe our mindset around movement. Take a second to ask yourself what you consider to be physical activity. Most people would respond by saying running, high intensity workouts, or hitting the gym. And while those answers aren't wrong, intense activities aren't the only activities that impact our health and well being. First, start with what you enjoy. To make physical activity part of our daily routine, Pick activities that work with your lifestyle and that you actually enjoy doing. Maybe that's going on a walk with your dog, biking around the neighborhood with your partner or your kids, or even playing in a recreational sports league. All physical activity is good activity. So take time to try a variety of things to see what best fits you. Next, set realistic expectations. When starting a physical activity routine, be gracious with yourself. Your body and your mindset will need time to adjust and you will have life events that get in the way of planned activity. It's easy to get excited or let motivation take over, so don't get discouraged if you fall a little short. Pick it back up the next day. This will help to avoid burnout, keep soreness at bay, and prevent you from feeling too overwhelmed. And finally, time it right. If you don't have 30 minutes before or after work, consider breaking it up throughout your day. Take a 10 minute walk after lunch, do a quick five minutes of your favorite activities in your living room, mow the lawn when you get home from work, or do a few yoga poses before you wind down for bed. I hope these tips help you find your favorite way to get up and moving. That's all for now. Thank you for joining me.